Hi guys, welcome to your guide. Today's lesson is a very, very special lesson. And you know, we will be celebrating Mother's Day in coming days. And today's lesson is a tribute to all the mothers of this country who do a lot of hard work each and every day to raise their children. So first of all, I would like to congratulate all the mothers and wish a very, very happy Mother's Day. So now let's talk about today's lesson. In this lesson, we are covering a very, very special song from the movie ABCD2 and this is Chunar. I'm sure you must have heard it. So take out your uke. Now check if your ukulele is in standard tune. And let's start learning Chunar on ukulele. So guys, to play this song, you need four chords and these chords are chord C, chord F, chord B flat and chord G sharp. To play chord C, you need to place your ring finger on third fret first string and chord C will sound like this. To play chord F, you need to place your index finger on 1st fret 2nd string and your middle finger on 2nd fret 4th string and chord F will sound like this. To play chord B flat, you need to bar 1st fret with your index finger and then you need to place your middle finger on 2nd fret 3rd string and your ring finger on 3rd fret 4th string and chord B flat will sound like this. To play chord G sharp, you need to bar 3rd fret with your index finger like this and then you need to place your middle finger on 4th fret 2nd string and your ring finger on 5th fret 4th string and chord G sharp will sound like this. So guys, let's talk about strumming and finger picking. In this song, we are using both. So let me first explain you the finger picking part. So to play the finger picking part, you have to hold a particular chord. And then you have to finger pick string 1, 2 and 3 from your right hand. And for that you will be using your ring finger, your middle finger and your index finger. So let's say we are holding chord C right now. So chord C is here. And then we have to finger pick like this. So slow and easy. One two three 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 one two three. So you will do it four times and then we have to introduce a bass note in this pattern. So you will do it like and then we have to introduce the bass note and right now we are playing chord C. So the bass note will be played from string 3 and string 1. So for that we can use our thumb and our ring finger simultaneously. So it will it will be played like this. So when we'll play it together it will sound like So you can see how we are finger picking the strings and introducing the bass notes. Now you have to do it four times and then you introduce the bass note and then you repeat the same pattern again. Now you will be repeating this whenever you are playing a particular chord. So when I will be singing this song for you, I will be explaining you all the chords and then you have to hold that chord and you will play the finger picking part. Now guys, let's talk about strumming pattern. In this song, we are using a common strumming pattern that is down, up, 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 down, up. So let me quickly show you how this strumming pattern sounds on a particular chord. So we are holding chord C. So it will look like down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. 
so guys if the finger picking part is difficult for you then you can use this strumming pattern while playing the first part of this song in the second part of this song i will be using this strumming pattern so you can play with me when i will be singing the song for you So guys, I hope you enjoyed this lesson and I'm sure now you must be busy learning this effectively so that you can play it for your mothers. So all the best for that. And uh, one more time, I would like to say that do subscribe Yuki Guide, hit the bell icon. You can also connect me on Instagram and uh, keep on supporting me guys. That's how I will bring more lessons for you in future. So until next time, do take care and bye bye.